Now, my name is Dr. Michael Rohn. I'm the Associate uh, Department Head for Graduate Studies in the Mechanical Engineering Department here at Virginia Tech. We have uh, about 300 graduate students. Um, that's uh, split half-half with the MS and PhD students. Um, we have over a thousand undergraduate students um, right now, which is um, one of the largest uh, undergrad populations uh, in, in the college for sure, if not at the university. Um, in terms of research, uh, whew, there's just it's hard to say what's not going. I mean, almost everything is, is occurring under our roof. Mechanical engineering has really evolved over the um, last decade to include things. We have a nuclear program, uh, all the way to more traditional things like heat transfer, propulsion, uh, acoustics, dynamics, autonomous vehicles, uh, autonomous air vehicles, underwater vehicles, uh, robotics, biomechanics, uh, and the list just goes on and on. What's really exciting is right now there's a new uh, building called the Signature Engineering Building that's going to be done mm, in about, I guess, we'll be moving in in about a year. Yeah, we have this really fantastic new building that's uh, uh, going to house many of our research labs. So it's a state-of-the-art building that uh, includes uh, some of our major robotics labs like the Romela Lab, that's uh, a uh, um, uh, hu humanoid robots, um, all kinds of really, really cool robotic systems like robotic snakes and jellyfish and, and, and you name it. Um, we're going to have uh, an advanced uh, manufacturing lab, which is, uh, you probably heard a lot about it in terms of uh, 3D printing, additive manufacturing uh, that will be uh, installed there. Uh, the majority of our faculty will be uh, housed in that building, as well as the whole uh, administrative system for the department, including the department head and the financial systems and all those things.